Another year, another time for the rich elite, celebrities, and everyone in between to flaunt the latest fashions and spend a ridiculous amount of money on looking the most fashionable. Oh yeah, and there's something about a fundraising gala for the Museum of Art's Costume Institute as well. This year's theme, Manus and Machina, fashion in an age of technology, and of course those walking the red carpet took that to the extreme. With that in mind, let's run down some of the five most interesting looks. Coming in at number five, Beyonce. Yes, Queen Bee continues to be so reckless when she rocks a Givenchy dress that was made out of latex. For a number four spot, Kim Ye. Kim K's Balmain gown was a metallic wonderland that would probably sound deadly during a thunderstorm. Normally fashionable for most occasions, Ye sported a Balmain jacket and ripped jeans. Then there's the contacts. At number three, Nicki Minaj. Accompanied by the gown designer and fashion icon Jeremy Scott, Miss Onika slayed in an all-black outfit. Taking runner-up with the number two spot is Future. Clearly, Future Hendrix fucked up some commas in this all-white ensemble. Sierra was there too, without Russell Wilson. Taking the number one spot is Nas Escobar himself, the definition of class and a New York state of mind. Bro looks straight out of coming to America. He even went classier for his performance alongside The Weeknd. What are your thoughts? Think we missed a few outfits? Let us know in the comments section. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and for more music and news, as always, visit hiphopdx.com.